We all like to think we're a pretty smart species. After all, we've come a long way since walking on all fours. In the last hundred years or so, I've seen a lot of rapid progress. But something strange is going on. You and I, we're getting stupider. The average IQ just ain't what it used to be, and it ain't an improvement. That's right, the average IQ is declining, dropping, falling off a cliff. On average, a person has lost about 10 IQ points. In case you're unaware of what IQ is, it's a measure of our intelligence, our ability to reason and problem solve. IQ stands for Intelligence Quotient and is expressed as a number between 85 and 115. If you're an American citizen watching this, you're probably thinking you don't have much to worry about. Because as Americans, that's what we do. We don't worry about the important shit. Just the mindless shit. Thing is, we ain't even in the top 10 nations with people that have high IQs. That means we ain't the smartest kid on the block. We're not even in the top 20. We come in halfway down the mark at 29th. At that mark, we don't even get a participation trophy. If you're wondering what the heck is going on with our IQ, there's a lot of people thinking that maybe it's a result of poor nutrition or perhaps just our generally bad health, maybe even the exposure to media. Or perhaps it's our declining quality of education. The problem in trying to figure out the declining trend in our IQ is that people trying to figure it out have lower IQs. They're stupid. Yep, their IQs have declined too. That's why they come with stupid excuses for our declining intelligence. Because don't it make sense that if we're getting stupider as the years go by, we're not going to be smart enough to eat good quality food, so we're all going to get fat? Doesn't it make sense that if we're stupider, our kids are being taught by stupider teachers? And don't it really make sense that if we're de-evolving, the headlines in the media would be all fake news because we'd be too stupid to print the truth. That's right, folks. What you see happening right here in America is the result of people being dumbed down. So if you're looking for the reason behind the demise of our intelligence, it ain't the fluoride. Because a smart person wouldn't put a ton of chemicals in your drinking water. Only a dumb person would. Personally, I think nature is just correcting a mistake, and in another 10 years or so, we might be swinging from our tree branches with our cousins. So what can we expect to see in the next few years as our intelligence continues to decline? First thing to understand is that there is no immunity. That said, the loss of intelligence isn't going to be uniform, which means some people are going to see some people acting Unbelievably stupid. The rich and powerful will be struck the hardest because they pay people that are supposed to be smarter than they are. And pretty quick here, you'll be seeing that play out because they'll do things like try to swim down the Titanic in a tin can or wanting to colonize Mars when there ain't no damn oxygen. Unfortunately, we're already seeing the lack of intelligence in our politicians. And that's because they've never really been all that smart to begin with. I fully expect to see a rise in those who believe in conspiracies, UFOs, myths, and monsters. Because when people struggle with reality, the stupid come up with some pretty cool excuses. We're already seeing people that have forgotten what soap, a toothbrush, and deodorant are for. And I'm sorry to say, even the damn president won't even know how to use toilet paper. Of course, our stupidity will be evidenced in our media with some of the stupidest headlines humans have ever come up with. So if you think it's bad now, just wait a bit. All in all, there's some good news. None of us are going to be smart enough to figure out what's going on. Ignorance really will be a bliss. Yeah, I did this. You know, if you're waking up in the morning feeling not as bright as you were yesterday, now you know why. You know, I've never been a big big believer in, in IQ. Some, I mean, assigning arbitrary 
points to people's intelligence. I mean, the truth is, not a lot of people look at, at IQ these days as as a as a method of measuring people's intelligence, or is it a method of measuring people's stupidity? Well, I don't know, but you know what? I'll leave it where it is. Something's going on. Don't know what. Something no. I can do a shot of tequila and I can ponder intelligence. Not a lot of intelligence seen out there today, but it's there somewhere. I don't know where. You're not going to find it here, that's for sure. Out of here. Love you. Thanks for watching. Take care of yourselves. Yes, you should.